Rhino Nation, we're coming to you today crazy excited about another great signee. Uh, you know, this young man uh, comes from across the world. You know, some of our, of our guys this year from, uh, you know, from foreign countries and Jose Serrano is no exception. Uh, Jose Serrano comes to us by way of Southwestern Community College out in California, where he spent the last couple of years playing with those guys. Uh, those guys run a great program, but Jose originally is from Venezuela, uh, and his whole family, uh, you know, still has ties and roots back there to Venezuela. So really excited about Jose. It's fun to have another international guy uh, just come and join our family. Uh, again, it's, it's, it's always impressive to me, you know, the reach of college basketball. Uh, you know, gone are the days where you go to the you know, the city's just right around your school uh, to be able to find people. We're able to find people all over the world. And so, uh, you know, crazy excited about what Jose is going to be able to bring to our family. Um, just kind of a, a backstory on Jose. Um, you know, he played at Southwestern Community College. That staff over there has been unbelievably helpful to us throughout the entire process. Um, I, you know, I think part of the reason why Jose chose Eastern and the Greyhound family is because I think it almost feels similar. Uh, you know, um, that, that entire coaching staff uh, kind of circles their players like a family. Uh, and, it, you know, it doesn't feel like being part of a uh, robotic team. It feels like being a part of something like we try to do here at Eastern New Mexico. So I think the fit is great. But we want to send out a shout out, uh, you know, Anthony, Dominic, uh, Aaron, and John, all those guys over there, uh, you know, who make up that coaching staff at Southwestern. They just from getting us out there to be able to see him to accepting us with open arms every time that we were around and just the communication that they were able to give us with Jose and helping him in his story, I think it's just something that we're really grateful for and we're thankful to those guys to help us make this happen. But, um, you know, Jose Serrano, 6'7", uh, you know, playing weight about 2'10", 2 2'15", uh, just a really big guy. Uh, you know, but the special thing about Jose is that at that size, at 6'7", he truly is a perimeter player, you know, and uh, it is, you know, Jose at 6'7", is an extremely skilled basketball player, uh, a high level of movement ability and a high level of scoring ability, uh, and so we really think he's going to help bolster and strengthen our perimeter scoring spots. So, uh, you know, I'll let Coach talk a little bit about his, you know, multiple skills, but, you know, we couldn't be more excited to have Jose with us. He's a guy that we've pursued for a long time, top 100 Juco camp for the Mullins system, uh, you know, uh, played in a Vegas, the Vegas event, you know, uh, as well in the top 80 West. He's just a guy that's been already singled out as one of the best junior college players in the country. And anytime you can be recruiting young men like that, that's as good a person as Jose really is. It's just, it, it, you know, it's just, it's a blessing. So I'll let Coach talk about some of his different skills and, and what all he's going to bring to our family. No, absolutely, man. Like, like you said, Coach, at, at six, seven, I mean, Jose is probably one of the most skilled guys yeah. that um, I love to coach. But, you know, from a perimeter standpoint, Jose at 6'7", I mean, he can see over the defense, yep. um, you know, quick enough, strong enough to definitely keep a man um, on his hip and on, the, and on that shoulder as he's driving by. Um, he can shoot the three uh, and an elite passer. You know, I, I think that's one of the most underrated Under, things. Yeah, it's sure. one of the most underrated things about his game is just how well he sees the floor and get other guys involved. And, you know, at the end of the day, he just wants to win. And I, I think that's what's most special about him, you know. He, 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 can score, he can score 20, he can do all these things, but, you know, to get his teammates involved is, is truly what's special about him. But, you know, you can play him at the, at, the, at, at the perimeter where, you know, like I said, he can shoot the three, he can take his man off the dribble. Um, smaller guys, he can post them up yeah, as well. Yeah. So we could just put him in, the, in a multitude of areas where he can be effective. And, and you know, it's almost like, in being around Jose, the more that we've recruited across the whole season, that's how his mind works. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, you don't have to explain to Jose how to use your skills and talents and size to hurt the defense. Like, that's already how he's thinking. And so, and again, in today's game, in the modern game of college basketball, that level of IQ is not as, as, as prominent as you would think. It, it takes a lot of coaching to make a guy understand how to implement his strengths into the floor. Absolutely. And Jose just knows that stuff. And, and again, we like to think that comes from his time growing up in Venezuela. Uh, you know, Venezuela, you know, experiencing a lot of problems right now as a country, it's a tough place to be. And Jose brings a lot of that raw and that, you know, just kind of uh, humility and humbleness in his spirit uh, to our family, to our team, which we feel like all this, I mean, all the things you said is just gonna add to our family and our toughness. He's a guy that wants to make it as a professional athlete, 
not for you know silly or selfish reasons, but you know genuinely he, he wants to make it so that he can help his family. Whether that be to get them out of the country of Venezuela and into America, or whether that be so that he can one day get back to Venezuela as a professional athlete, and, and obviously uh, the pride that comes along with that to represent his country as on the professional level. So it's I mean, it's crazy. I mean, him coming from Venezuela, like he's already established himself. You know, obviously as a top Juco player, yeah. but it goes far beyond that to yeah. high school. I mean, he played with DeAndre yeah. in high school, you know, yeah. um, and a couple of guys that have gotten drafted in this year's draft class. So he already has that stigma about him, that that, that pro um, mentality about him, you know, from day one when he stepped into America. So yeah. no question. And, 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 you know, as, as we've recruited more young men that have gone overseas, you know, all those guys from last year being able to make, a, you know, pro contracts happen last season. Our guys right now are still searching for those pro contracts. It, it becomes a, a thing of our program. That's something that we want to do here is provide a platform for these young men to go on to the next level and live out a dream that they've had since they were little kids. And so we're quite confident that's where Jose is going to be heading. But first, we got two great years of college basketball with him here at the Greyhounds. Uh, you know, we, we uh, uh, another reason why he chose us, we feel like, is because he believes in the strength of what we've already been able to find. Uh, he, you know, he, he looked through our entire signee list, the videos that we've been making for you guys. He's seen the same ones to learn about our guys we've already signed, and he just believes in the family that we've been able to build. And so, um, very, very proud of Jose and what he's done already. He's uh, overcome a lot of adversity to get to the States, to be in America, and, and to be uh, the man that he is already. Uh, he's got a lot of people around him. Uh, you know, he's got uh, his girlfriend, Valerie. I mean, she's a huge part of his life. And, and she's a big part of his inspiration and why he does what he does and why he holds himself to the high standards that he does. And so I know her whole family is excited about the signing. Jose's whole family is. Uh, he's got a couple of brothers, uh, you know, that are excited about this thing and, and, are, and are hoping to make their dent in the college basketball world at some point in time. So. Um, to Greyhound Nation, we're getting another great one here with Jose Serrano. He's going to be a guy that's going to add some flair and again some 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 you know some some overseas you know kind of kind of you know flair to to our program. We're excited about the way he plays, the way he carries himself as a young man. Uh, you know, he's a guy that's going to come in and major in business and want to be you know a student athlete that that represents us in all ways. And so we're just we couldn't be more excited about what Jose is capable of bringing to us. Uh, I think you're going to see more and more of our team that we're going to be big. You know, Jose is going to be a six-seven wing. You know, and so he's a guy that really helps us in that way. He'll play some forward a little bit for us as well, add us some versatility, and be able to make this perimeter on both sides of the you know of the positions you know really dangerous. And so. Um, Jose, thank you for your support, your loyalty to us, to all the coaching staff out there at Southwestern. Thank you so much for all the help that you gave us and the patience you gave us in sticking with the process. And to all of Jose's family that are celebrating with him today, uh, I wish I could say it you know, uh, you know, in, in, in your native language, but we love you and we're glad that you're a part of the Greyhound family. Greyhound Nation, man, you're getting a high IQ, high motor, elite athlete, um, just a, an overall great basketball player. Um, and he's very personable, yeah. so he'll fit right <laughs> yeah. in with our coach. Jose's, Jose's gonna have a fake one for sure. Yeah, exactly. So he'll fit right in with our culture, man. And Jose is a true winner. So I'm excited. Thank you, Jose. Thank you to his, his junior college coaches. Thank you to his family. We're all excited. You know, go Greyhounds. <laughs>